I'm Janelle Schala, and I'd like to introduce you to a rare and unusual mineral called colmenite. Colmenite is a borate similar to tunnelite, which I've already covered, and as with tunnelite, it's monoclinic, and it comes from the boron mines in Boron, California. I'm going to start off by showing you a beautiful, sparkly, clear crystal, that, a crystal cluster here that has lots of little needle-like crystals, very delicate, very gentle. Now, as I mentioned, colmenite is very similar to tunnelite in the way it works. There are some differences, but just to recap on what I've said before about tunnelite, it fills the body with light. It clears and increases, clears stagnation, clears things you don't want, stimulates the immune system, stimulates the flow of energy, it supports the thyroid. It also helps with clearing the lungs and heart when there are things, issues going on there. And on a spiritual level, it helps induce a deep state of meditation, which can bring you to a very, very high level or high frequencies, helping you to work interdimensionally, particularly on very high dimensions, so talking about angels, nature spirits, etc. Again, as with tunnel light, not necessarily in communication, but more the energies of these dimensions. I'm going to show you another one while I continue discussing it. Now, colmenite forms in some really unusual ways, so you get these crystals that form little points that are other colors. So you have browns like this one that I'm showing you. You might have a golden color, but they don't seem to form straight. They all seem to go slightly off to one side. They're very beautiful. Now with colmenite, what is different about it? What, what I find the main difference with this one between this and, and tunnel light is that it feels that the energy is much higher. It doesn't keep you as grounded as tunnelite does. So when you're working with it, you're working on a very high frequency. I suggest that you be conscious of this when you start playing with it so that you're not taking yourself off and having trouble coming back and getting grounded again. Probably best, unless you're a collector, to start working with it if you've already been working with energy quite a while. I'm going to show you one final piece. This is another clear piece with much larger crystals than the crystals I showed you on the first piece. All of these are stunningly beautiful. This one in particular, if you look at it, it reminds me of angel wings. 